So hi guys, welcome back to another video on AJ5. So as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be reviewing and unboxing or unpacking more like this 3D number plate which I received a few days ago. As you can see, it's already been opened. I'm not going to show you the whole plate, but I'm just going to see how... Let me just hide it like that. So I'm just going to... So as you can, I'm going to show you a little bit of it. As you can tell, it's, it's uh, one side has been brand new, so it hasn't been. So I just have to take the stickers off at the top. So as you can see, the last bit says OXO, and on the other side, it's all it has already been taken off. So that's the three millimeter one. So let me just try and focus and show you guys in a bit more detail. So this has been raised by three millimeters as you can tell like here and i've got my other number plate which is raised by six millimeters so that's uh that will be double this so it should uh, you can work out how much double is that so it, should, uh, it looks much thicker but obviously this is because just because this is just three millimeters it doesn't look that thick but it's still all right um you know some people don't like it when it's too thick so they go for the three millimeter one which is this one here three millimeters but obviously you can get um you can also get obviously the bit and obviously this is just a back bit here uh what does it say nick nikolai 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 i don't know but yeah this is a three millimeter one and there's also a gel version, so it's uh, raised by 3mm, but it's more like a gel rather than, you know, solid like this. It has a, a gel effect on it, but I don't quite like the gel effect, so I just thought, let me just get the normal 3D, 3mm one. And there's also a 4D one, actually, so the 4D one is called, is 6mm, so... Uh, I mean, they call it both. This could be the three millimeter. Sorry, this could be the three D and four D. But yeah, it's mainly raised. It's, the main feature is that it's raised by three millimeters, and yeah, and also you can also get like uh, other number plates with different colors on the outline. So you can get red, white, black, blue, green, whatever color. It just goes on the outside here, or you can get like a number plate where. It's, it's clear at the bottom and then it's black on top but i don't want to go for one that's too you know when you overdo it it doesn't look ugly i mean it, it looks it doesn't look ugly when you have it like this but when once you put it on a car and start driving it it doesn't look that great so i thought let me keep it simple and we just go with three millimeter one if you guys want me to review the six millimeter number plate uh let me know in the comments down below or dm me and i'll do that for you guys also, if you guys want to know where I got this from, it's very stable, you know, it doesn't come off. I've bought the from them previously, so if you guys want a link or want to know who I got this from, just send me a DM. All my socials are in the description down below. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this unpacking or unboxing of this 3D number plate and the review of it. So yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure most of you came to see how it looks like, so I'm showing you here. Wait, let me just get the top number plate. I'll leave the bottom one. So this is basically how it looks like from the sides. Let me focus it. Yeah, there we go. That's how it looks like. So yeah, I quite like it. On my car, I've got the 6mm one, but obviously some people like it when it's not too thick or, you know, so yeah, if you don't like it too thick, I'll suggest you go for the three millimeter one. Looks quite nice. So yeah, looks different. So yeah, guys, uh, that's been a quick video on the review of this number plate. So hope you enjoyed it. Hope you got something out of this video. And yeah, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Take care and peace.